Yo, at first, I didn't think there were a lot of kicks dropping this week, but I was wrong. Like, really wrong. There's some really good stuff dropping this weekend. <laughs> Welcome to the Heat Check. I am your host, Jacques Slade, and let's start the show with some stuff that has been getting some buzz today, actually. The Nike Zoom Fly. This is the modified version of the shoe Nike used for the Breaking 2 marketing campaign, and they're designed to help you literally feel like you're running faster. Finish Line has the Ocean Fall colorway, and I actually want to try these out myself, and those are available right now for $150. There's also the Nike Lab version of the shoe that is dropping for the same price, but those are going to be really hard to get. On the flip side, the Pegasus 34 is dropping today in a few different colorways. The Pegasus is an updated Nike classic that runners still use to this day to get miles, and those are 110. On the three-stripe side of the fence, they are putting out some of their best product yet, case in point, the Ultra Boost collaboration with Parley. The second installment of the collab released today and features the Ultra Boost, the Ultra Boost X, and the Ultra Boost Uncaged. Each shoe is partly made with plastic waste from the ocean, and each of those will cost you $200 if you can get your hands on a pair. Heading back to Beaverton, the Nike Special Forces Air Force One Mid or the SFAF One Mid dropped today as well in the Tire Camo colorway. These got a lot of buzz when they originally dropped, but the last batch of colorways hasn't been making the noise the other versions did. This Tiger Camo version is pretty nice though when you can grab those for $170. Switching gears to tomorrow, Nike Basketball is bringing some more platinum love with the PG One. The rest of the Nike squad, well, they already had their pairs, so it's time for Paul George to get his pair, and these only cost $110, and you can grab a pair over at Finish Line. Keeping basketball on the brain, the Nike Air Foam Posit Pro is dropping tomorrow as well, but with a slightly different upper. This pair will be winter ready, just in time for summer, with a fleece upper that mixes gray and black. As this is the pro model, you can expect those to hit you for $230. Moving ahead to Saturday, things get interesting with the DJ's Originals dropping a bunch of NMDs. The brand looks to be headed back to the R1 days with an icy blue and also a trace green and a few other colorways. While the NMD is not as comfortable as the Ultra Boost, it is lighter and more of a lifestyle model in the event you don't plan on actually running in your shoes. Those will cost you $130. Continuing with Saturday releases, Jordan Brand is showing some love for those with smaller feet with a new look at the Air Jordan 4. The official name of this model is the Air Jordan 4 Linen, and it rocks a mostly white upper, but Jordan Brand has actually updated it a bit with a little color they're calling light sand. The result actually looks pretty good, and I think I would probably rock this pair if it came in my size. Those will cost you $140 or less, depending on the size you pick up over at Finish Line. On the restock tip, the LeBron 14 Adjumat, I hope I'm saying that right, is said to be returning this weekend. If you recall, the restock for this Philippines-inspired sneaker has been moving around a bit and the latest talk seems to be set on this weekend. While I can't 100% say that it's going to happen, if you do want a pair, stay ready with your $175. And finally, Jordan Brand is dropping a version of the Air Jordan 13 that sneakerheads have been clamoring for, the Air Jordan 13 Low Chutney. This colorway originally released almost 20 years ago and it is good to see Jordan Brand bringing it back. The Chutney Upper is one of the most unique looks we've seen on the Air Jordan 13 and you can grab a pair for $175 over at Finish Line. As with every week, there may be a few other things dropping, but I just wanted to give you guys the quick highlights on the stuff that I thought you would be paying attention to. As always, I am Jacques Slade. This is the Heat Check presented by Finish Line, and I appreciate you. Make sure you turn on your notifications for the channel, and I'll see you soon. Peace.